guys, so I am Rosalind and welcome back to my channel. So this is my first favorites video for 2016 and I hadn't done one of these favorite videos for the past few months so I'm so excited to share with you my favorites. I have a little bit of beauty and a few other things that way I can mix it up and sorry for the lighting. I am using natural light so sometimes the sun is bright like now or sometimes it will get a little bit dark. So, in the meantime, let's get started! Okay, so my first beauty favorite is this Marc Jacobs mascara. And I love this mascara so, so much. I actually, I am subscribed with Influencer and basically they will give you free products in exchange of reviews. And this time I got the new mascara, which is Velvet Noir. And oh my goodness, it has been my favorite because it gives me a lot of volume. And I actually did a review on my blog, so I'm going to leave that in the description box where I leave my photos before and after. And that way you can see the major difference that it does for my lashes. And you can kind of see the volume that I have on my lashes. It almost feels like I'm wearing false lashes. All I do is apply two coats of this and it will last all day long. I really like it. And another thing that I like about this is that it's cruelty free. Only downside is that it doesn't focus on having natural ingredients. So that's the only downside for me. But overall, I just love how amazing the results are. And I saw this retails for like $20 to $25 at Sephora. So getting this for free is amazing. So I will also leave the link so that way you can subscribe and get free products as well. Mm -hmm. And up to this day, I would say this is my favorite mascara, so I highly recommend it. Okay, so my next favorite product is this DIY face toner. And basically, all I use were roses and filtered water. So all you do is boil the water, put in the rose petals, it can be red or white roses, and strain the water, and that's it. And you get natural face toner, or it could be for your hair. And it's so simple and easy to make, and it has a lot of benefits. It fights acne, it freshens and softens your skin, it balances the pH on your skin. You can use it to set up your makeup so you can spray it afterward. You can use it as a cold treatment if you have sunburn or you can use it as light perfume. So as you can see, it has a lot of benefits and I just recommend that if you do this DIY toner, just use glass bottle or BPA free bottle. That way you make sure that all those chemicals is not getting into it. I'm just reusing this bottle. This is the one that I was using before and you can also buy but just make sure it is made from Bulgarian roses. That's where they have the most natural and best quality roses to make these kind of products instead of the ones that are made from rose oil which is not too good. I'm also gonna leave that in the description box which I'm considering buying once I use this one up. So every time that I go to Whole Foods, my favorite section is checking out the beauty aisle and I just love seeing what perfumes or fragrance oils that they have and I came upon this brand that is new to me. It's called Kumba or Kumba and they have so so many and the bottles are small. They range about $10 but all you have to do, it has a roll on and you have to apply a little bit. I like applying it inside my wrist and behind my ears and this one in particular, I love it so much. It smells very soft, feminine, very floral and I just love it. And the other one that I wanted to get, it was not in stock, so I cannot wait to go back and get some more. And the great thing about these is that they have all natural oils, so it's not like the conventional perfumes that they are so expensive, they are full of chemicals that is not good for your health. One downside to these is that it doesn't say or display the ingredients, so you don't know which ones have honey in case you are vegan you would have to send them an email and that way find out but other than that i just love this brand for it being so natural and i love it so so much <laughs> okay next i want to talk about this book that i got for my sister in december for christmas and it's called eat pretty so basically this focuses on how to look great from your inside out so it all depends on what you eat what you drink 
how it will benefit to eat healthy to eat fruits and veggies and it tells you all the benefits so for example if you eat celery it helps with skin hydration raspberries for very nice hair ginger for anti-aging defense nutmeg for beauty sleep beets for sun protection and so on so I've seen parts of this book because at the moment I am reading another book but this is the book that I'm gonna be reading as soon as I'm done with the other one and this book includes many recipes and it tells you the benefits of, of fruits and veggies for example if you eat lemon it will strengthen blood vessels if you have garlic it will stop wrinkle formation and so on so depending on what you're going to be eating you just look it up in this book and it tells you the vitamins that it has and how it will help with your beauty and just look at how pretty this is i love the design i love how it is colorful and it has flowers even on the inside pages it has more and more flowers so i like that and it has recipes like for smoothies, dressings, salads. The only downside is that if you're vegan or a vegetarian, you won't be able to apply some of these recipes because the book mentions fish, eggs, honey. So that's the only downside. Other than that, I like this book in general, but if you know of a vegan book that is similar to this one, please let me know because I would love to check it out. Okay, next I want to talk about an app that I have been using for the whole month of January and it's called Kindara. So basically with Kindara, you get to learn more about your body and you get to take your temperature each morning. And you record it here and it will have a chart and that way you know when you're going to be ovulating, when you are fertile, when you're going to be getting your period. And I just find it so helpful and I have been learning so much about my own body. I already knew about this concept it wasn't until now that I have been applying it and learning so many new things that I didn't know before and it's great to know that by just knowing your temperature you know when you're gonna be getting your period in case you're planning for a baby when are when are you most fertile or if you're not ready for a baby when are the days that is not safe and it's been a great app what I like to do I set up my alarm for 7 a.m. each morning I take my temperature and that's it so it's very simple to use. You could say it's a natural way of birth control if you are preventing pregnancy at this time. So I recommend you check it out if you haven't used it before, but I like it so, so much so far. Next, I want to talk about my planner for 2016. So when I was looking for a new planner, I was looking for something that is eco-friendly, something made with soy-based ink. That's what I have been using for the past three years by the brand Green Room. Later, they changed to a different name. And I still wanted to get a planner by that same brand, but I wasn't able to find any. So instead, I found this by Sugar Paper. And what I like about Sugar Paper is that they have very nicely designed planners. They're not too colorful. They have subtle colors. They look moderate, and that's my style. So I got this one with striped lines, and it says 2016. And it has the monthly tabs right here. I just added a few notepad papers here. And it has these squares for each month that way you can put like the most important events and then it has more space for each week as you can see so in here i will add a little bit more of detail in case i have an event and the last section that it has are notes so it has plenty of pages for you to write notes and to me it's perfect because this is where i'm gonna be writing my ideas for later blog posts or video ideas and it's not too big it fits in any purse or any bag and i just love the simplicity because i i had seen other planners but to me they're bigger like the ellen conrad planner to me that's way too colorful it has too many colors you have to put into it a lot of details and it's not too cheap and i just wanted something simple that i can write my to-do list for the day because if i have a long list or things to do i become overwhelmed and instead of helping me it gives me a little bit of anxiety it stresses me so i just wanted something small simple that i can write what i have to do without writing too much if that makes any sense but yeah i just love this planner so far and i like it <laughs> okay the last thing that i wanted to talk about if you have pandora 
I wanted to recommend a radio station that I have been listening to, which is Café Tropical. Or at nighttime when I'm doing dishes or getting dinner prepared, and I leave this music in the background, and I love how it always makes me feel alive. It it gets me in such a good mood. It makes me so happy, and it just makes me feel like if I'm traveling or I'm at a vacation spot, and it just sets up the mood, and I really like that. <laughs> And like I said, I have been listening to this every single day. So in case you're looking for something new, maybe you might like this station. <laughs> okay, so that's it, you guys. So I hope you have enjoyed this favorite video. So I cannot wait to make more of these videos in 2016. And as always, if you have liked this video, you can give it a thumbs up. That lets me know that you have enjoyed this video. Or you can leave me a comment and that way we can get to know each other better. And if you're not subscribed yet, you can do that now. And that way you get a notification every time that I make a new video. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! Mm -mm -mm. Basically, they give you free products. Oh, there's a lot of noise. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of noise. Oh.